What's up everybody? How is it going? So today we are gonna do a little bit of exploring. Uh, <clears throat> so I've got a mission for myself. I want to make an enchantment table. Um, I've got down here I've got this 18 levels of uh, experience I guess they're called and I want to use those. I want to use those to enchant some tools to uh, make better tools. Um, I've got a whole bunch of sand in this area over, over here where this creeper is who just saw me and he's about to attack me. Oh, but I've got that knockback. Nice. That's actually pretty cool. I don't know. That's cool. Sweet. I got some gunpowder. Cool. I can make more TNT. Um, <clears throat> so anyways, I've got this uh, uh, area, and I want to make I want to make everything flat. But it's going to take me a long time to dig out all that sand if I don't have any better tools than just a little uh, iron shovel. But in the last episode, I did find a whole bunch of diamonds. Uh, I've got a few diamonds back in my uh, chest here. But I've got a whole bunch of diamonds now, and I want to make a good, solid, diamond-enchanted shovel. But in order to do that, i got to make... Okay, so I got three here. Wow, that is just so annoying. I'm going to have to move that away from my house. Wow, that is just super annoying. Um, so I'm going to have to make a pick. I'm going to have to... Well, okay, so here's my problem. I'm going to have to make an enchanted enchantment table. I need, I think, it's four uh, pieces of obsidian. And the only way to break obsidian is with a diamond pickaxe. So I need to make a diamond pickaxe also. And a diamond shovel. So, <clears throat> uh, one there for the shovel. And then I also like to put on three there for the pickaxe. That way I can grab the pickaxe and then the pieces of the shovel are already there. I just think it's fun to, I don't know, minimize the... Uh, uh, effort there. Oops, sorry, wrong chest. We'll go ahead and put that up here. That is a block also. Block, blocks, the block. Um, let's put those back away. We don't need those carrying around. Um, we can put, let's put half of those away. <coughs> and what else? We don't need to carry that. I guess I could Hmm, I don't know what I want to use that for, so I'm not going to use it yet. Uh, don't need to carry your rotten flesh around. Bucket is always good to have in case I'm on fire. In fact, let's get it in a good, accessible place. That way I could just bam, put it, put it to use. Um, actually, I don't need fences because I'm, I don't need to carry them around because I'm not doing anything with the farm. So put that away, put the chest away, that, or those are technically blocks as far as I'm concerned at this point in time. Don't forget to put the gold and iron away. That would be nice to have accessible. I could have shot that creeper actually, but <clears throat> again, it'd be nice to enchant my bow a little bit. Don't need to carry feather. That's all the oh, arrows. Okay, I got some arrows. Um... Oh, actually, I've got another bow. That'll be another good mission, is to make an anvil. That's new, something I've never, ever used before, is an anvil. Um, that is similar. I believe you could... Okay, let's see what. Let's see how this works, see if I can try and explain it. Um, uh, if you put two of these two things in there, you get one, but it's not perfect. Um, I believe with an anvil... Pff, I don't even know why I did... I, didn't actually mean to do it, um, because it was kind of a waste of bow. Uh, I guess I get lots of bows dropped, so no big deal, but <clears throat> an anvil will help, uh, at, uh, help with, uh, things like that, but it has more likelihood of saving your enchantment. 
Um, it's just a good way to combine things. See, I'm just I'm terrible at explaining stuff like that. So I would love to do like a tutorial, but um, I guess if I put my mind to it, I could really sit down and think about all the stuff that I would need to explain. But as it is, we're just kind of going to go with a, uh, a let's play and you guys get to come along on a little adventure. <clears throat> So we're going on down into the uh, cave dungeon system thingy. Um, I remember I was blocking this off from all the villagers. I don't know if that's still necessary or not. I guess with the, with all of them spawning up there, it's not really necessary. Because if they die, somebody will spawn again. So not really a problem. Um... I'm going to grab this iron while I'm here. I don't know how I missed that before. Uh, okay. <clears throat> so, yeah. It's always good to be down in the down in the cave on an adventure. Don't want to forget where I'm going, but at the same time, I've really only got one mission. It's not really to collect iron. It's uh, to collect some obsidian. And while that's usually not a very fun thing to do, that's really all I have on my agenda today. Oh, there it is. There is the obsidian. Oh, hey, this is like where I found those. Is that where I found the diamonds before? No, no, there was some other... There was another... There's a whole bunch of lava in that area, but <clears throat> anyways, uh, this is how you collect obsidian. It's with a diamond pickaxe, and it takes a long, long time. I don't know if I'll speed this up or not. Probably not, just so that you guys can tell how long it takes to break one block. Um, it's not fast at all. I think I need four blocks of obsidian to make my... Uh, enchantment table and I got two already and I'm working on my third one there's the third one so we'll grab those up and one more oh, okay Minecraft lesson don't stand on the block you're breaking especially in this case because there is very likely to be lava down there in fact now that I say that I'm gonna waste my shovel if there is lava down there and there's not, so <clears throat> it's safe. I suppose there could be lava behind it, but there's more, I'm more likely to get the drop and grab that before the lava spreads. Let's see, if that lava had spread, I could have grabbed that and gotten out of there. But okay, I think all I need is four obsidian, so I am actually gonna go ahead and go on home. Um, be nice to collect all the resources that I can while I'm down here, but. You know, really only got that one mission, so um, mission accomplished, and uh, let's go home. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> so, good times down in the dungeon. We'll go ahead and walk on the balance beam across. Uh, don't fall in the little tiny hole. And we'll go back on up home. Um, okay, so the next piece of the puzzle I need. I had diamond, I need obsidian, and I also need books. So, I could either take these bookshelves, which are only going to drop books. I only need one book, so I could do that. Or I could take my one single piece of leather and some sugar cane. So I'm going to go grab some sugar cane from my sugar cane farm. Ooh, <laughs> I hurt myself on the way down. And I grab a piece, few pieces of sugar cane. <clears throat> uh, sugar cane is what's used to make paper. And to combine paper and leather, you get a book. So grab up these pieces of sugar cane and head back to the crafting bench. Um, yeah, talking weird. <clears throat> uh, it is almost nighttime, so uh, we're gonna get this done real quick. Three pieces of that, 
And we'll go ahead and make a couple extra pieces of paper. We got times six. Combine one, two, three pieces of leather, and, or paper and a piece of leather. I'm pretty sure you can do it in any order. Doesn't matter. You get one book. So, now that we have that, I'll we'll grab our diamond. Oops, one diamond. And we will combine four pieces of obsidian. Huh, I think it was two diamonds actually now that I look at it. Silly me. Um, two diamonds. Grab those pieces. Okay, so. Wow, that is just the worst. I gotta, I gotta fix that. Uh, that noise in the background is just killing me. So, two diamonds, that, and we have an enchantment table. Alright, so it is nighttime and the sun has gone down, so now that we have our enchantment table, <clears throat> uh, next time we will place it in one of these other houses, and we'll start enchanting some stuff. So, have a good night.